Hi, this is Adam, a small town machine shop. We got a little package here for something for the shop we're gonna try out. So I haven't opened it yet. And as you'll probably be able to tell from the title of this video and probably the thumbnail, this is a 220 single phase to three phase 10 horsepower VFD. Very well packed. Ordered this off eBay, off the recommendations of Cody from Hidden World Forge. He's been running the uh, Big LeBlanc, or not Big LeBlanc, the Big Reed Prentice, and it's seven and a half horse motor off one of these, and he's been very happy with it. So I figured I'd pick up one and do some testing with it. So as you see, it came very well packed. Nice stout looking unit. It's got a fan on top, which is, I'll be supplementing that as well. Phase input to 20 volt. There's all the output. Three phase, 220 volt, 50. 50 amp. So there we go. Now, I work around in my day job VFDs all the time. Everything from 10 horse up to 200 horse. So I'm very familiar with VFDs. See if anyone has the. Okay, so uh, the biggest thing that kills VFDs is heat. So, I'm excited to see this one has a fan on top. Maybe a little small. But the case is nice and open. There's the big caps in the bottom. So, I'll be adding a fan that blows in from the bottom. And then out or down there and through there. So, I'll, put up, I'll add two more fans to it. Because heat is the number one killer of these. And you can keep them cool. They, it really, really extends their life. I'm pretty, you know, especially on these cheaper ones. I paid 175 bucks for this with before shipping. So my plan for it is I'm going to put this on the big LeBlanc with its 10 horse motor, and I'm going to flog it. I mean, I'm going to run this thing for all it's worth. All I can squeeze, all the power I can squeeze out of this through that motor. And see how see how it does. The reason for this on the LeBlanc is I this for I want to test it out and see how it works on something that big. I know VFDs work really well on smaller machines, but you know bigger, older motors. And you see, as the thing for putting it remote. And all that good stuff. Very easy to follow instructions. Two pages on using your finger to push it back in. So, so yes, I'll go pick up some wiring. Actually, I'm going to save just a brief glance. This instruction book is very easy to follow as far as the pins and all that. I've never had one from this company before. I've had some one and three horse VFDs in the past. So, yeah, what I want to do with this is I'm going to hook it up to the, like I said, to the LeBlanc. And we'll go after it a bit and see what we can do. And see how this guy handles it. Because the LeBlanc is at the very extreme of what my rotary phase converter will handle. It does turn it fine. And actually, if I run another motor too, it runs a little smoother. But just so, you know, for how cheap this was, you know, just we'd we'll, we'll like to thought it was worth giving it a try. Even as far as running electrical and stuff, because I I move my machines and stuff so much, I might contemplate. I need a VFD anyway for the big Camelback drill press. 
and because I'm going to run that off a of five horse motor, so I could use this for that um, with some setting changes. And so since I had to get one anyway, I figured I'd get a ten horse one and uh, go through it and do all that. And also the planer's going the planer's not going to get a ten horse motor or a seven and a half horse motor or probably even a five, but. But if I'm happy with this brand, I'm, I'm at, you know, I'm sure it's made by a million people. Because when I ordered this, they said they had two left, but in the recommended ones, it showed this exact one sold by like 12 different people. And I ordered this last Thursday, and it came in yesterday. So it only took it four days to get to my house. So that I was quite impressed with that. So yeah, we'll get this uh, wired in and see how it does see if it's something you guys might be interested in picking up so yeah very cool this is adam from small time machine shop please comment like and subscribe and thanks for watching